This video is part of a series. Be sure to check out the description of the video for a link to the full playlist. I recommend watching the previous videos. And um, we're just continuing with some basic shell script commands here. Today we're going to look at putting processes in the background and then bring them back to the foreground. I'm going to use an example here. Top. Top is a command you probably have installed on your system. And it shows you you're running processes with well, some other system information. I can hit Q on my keyboard to quit out of that. Control L to clear the screen. Uh, but let's say I wanted to, to just suspend that in the background. I can press type top and I can press control Z and it puts it in the background. You can see the process number and the background number here. And I continue doing other stuff, blah, blah, blah. When I'm done and I want to bring top back to the foreground, I can type in FG for foreground and there it is, it's still running. Uh, I can then again press control Z to suspend it in the background. And I can now also say sleep for one minute. That's sleeping for a minute. I can press Control Z to suspend that in the background. Now I have two processes suspended in the background. How do I bring them back to the foreground? Uh, well, if I type in FG and press enter, it's gonna bring the last one in the list, which is the sleep command. I can Control C to kill that and then FG to bring up top again and then I can press Q out of that. Now, as I've mentioned in previous videos, I'm running Z shell and I seem to be having an issue with my foreground command. So again, if I run top control Z to background that process, sleep for one minute and then control Z to background that process, I should be able to type in FG and one since that's the background process number and it should bring that job to the front, but it's not. And I should be able to do two and it should bring the other process to the front, it doesn't. So FG brings, without any number, brings the last process, and I can do FG again to bring top. So that seems to be an issue with my, I don't know if it's Z shell in general or my setup, but uh, what I can do here is I'll just start up bash to give you an example of how it's supposed to work. So now I can type in top, control Z to throw that in the background, sleep, for one minute and throw that in the background. I can even start another process called HTOP, which is a bit nicer variation of top. Control Z to throw that in the background. So now I got three processes suspended in the background. Um, so what I can do now is I can do FG if I want to go to top, which was process one, I can do one and it brings that up and I can quit out of that. Uh, I can do FG and I can do uh, two, which brings me to my sleep process, which is uh, was stopped and is now running. And I can do FG and three, and that will bring me back to HTOP. So for some reason, my setup Z uh, shell, it isn't working like that. That's how it's supposed to work though. And uh, that is one way to throw a process in the background using Control Z. So I thought, hope you enjoyed this video. Be sure to check out uh, the full playlist. Again, link in the description of the video. As always, I hope that you have a great day.